Good morning. Welcome to WJZ.com. Let me step out of the shot for a second. What an interesting sunrise. A lot of people traveling or a lot of chemtrails. A discussion for a different time. Take a look at radar. Not a whole lot happening over the mid-Atlantic, but what we're seeing out to the west, as we've been talking about for a couple of days, is a very vigorous storm system, bringing either snow, uh, severe spring-like weather, or blustery conditions to you know, at least 20 states and millions of folks. And the net result for us, though, is going to be this big warm front coming right up the coast, and it is dragging rain with it. They, again, we've been discussing this scenario for the past couple of days. Great consistency in the forecast. Rain will get in here early Friday and exit really by an early bedtime at the absolute latest from the complete state on Friday late evening, early night. Then high pressure comes into play and some cooler, not necessarily colder air moves our way. Let's take a look at the mid-Atlantic future cast and time that rain out for you just a little bit better. By 2 a.m. Friday, rain sits just out to the west of the state. Look at that big envelope of warm air. And then it's going to be cutting across the region and again, gone out of the metro by 7, 8 o'clock, out of the state by before midnight, frankly. Then well offshore skies clearing during the overnight. Let's talk temperatures. 56 today, overnight tonight, we'll call it 41, getting a blanket effect because of some clouds. Then tomorrow, we're going to amp it up into the mid-60s. 67 on Friday, mild again. There's, there's that shower activity. Here comes the cooler, not necessarily colder air. The normal today is 53 as a high, 33 as a low by the weekend, 54, 34. The northern, the northern hemisphere is really heating up now. We're changing these normals every few days instead of every couple of weeks. So 52, 50, 50, 49, yeah, going to be below normal, but not cold. We'll just say cooler and cool. Thank you so much for stopping by WJZ.com.